instead of randomly assigning refugees to locations, what the algorithm does is it's basically looking at the refugee, his or her characteristics, say their age, their gender, their country of origin, and it's trying to figure out what's the best possible place where we could send that refugees such that they are most likely to succeed. <laughs> our tests where we apply this to the historical data and basically say, okay, what would have happened had we used this algorithm instead of the actual allocation? We find that the employment rate of refugees, for example, about doubles in the United States, and we got a similar result uh, for Switzerland. And so this is an, a nice result in a way because it suggests that through a better allocation, which doesn't cost you more money, um, you can improve the lives of refugees and make sure that you're setting them up for success. Mm -hmm.